In this example, we've got the region between the curve defined by x equals t squared plus 1, y equals t take away t squared. The x-axis and the lines x equals 1 and x equals 2 is rotated through 360 degrees about the x-axis. Find the volume of revolution which is formed. OK, so the volume is going to be equal to the integral between 1 and 2 of pi y squared dx. Now, we're going to need to convert this into parametric form. So this is going to be the integral of. Now, we need to get the limits right. So when x equals 1 and x equals 2, so we're going to put 1 equal to t squared plus 1, because that's x. And we're also going to put 2 equal to t squared plus 1. So, subtracting 1 from both sides, we're going to get t squared is 0, so t is 0. So when x is 1, t is 0. And we've got 2 is equal to t squared plus 1. So subtract 1 from both sides. So t squared is equal to 1, which means t is equal to plus or minus 1. Now, which should we use? Now, in order to check, OK, we substitute the 2t values back into this, into the y values, to confirm that we are actually on the x-axis. So we need y to be 0. So when t is 1, we get 1 take away 1, which is 0. So that's all good. When t is minus 1, we get minus 1 take away minus 1 squared, which is minus 1 take away 1, which is minus 2. So that's no good. So that means t is 1. Pi y squared, then dx by dt, dt. OK. So I'm going to bring the pi out to the front, 0 to 1. We've got y squared, which is t take away t squared squared, times by dx by dt, which is 2t. And we've got the dt. OK. So I think what I'll do is I'll bring the 2 out to the front of the integral as well. I've also got to expand the brackets out. So we're going to have t squared, and then I'm going to multiply that by t. So we're going to have t cubed. We'll have t times minus t squared twice. So that would be minus 2t cubed times by the t. So minus 2t to the 4. Then I'm going to have minus t squared times minus t squared, which is t to the 4 times by t, so plus t to the 5 dt. So that's expanding the brackets out. So we have 2 pi, now integrate. So 1 quarter t to the 4, take away 2 fifths t to the 5, plus 1 sixth t to the 6, evaluated between 0 and 1. So we've got the 2 pi out the front. Substituting the 1 would be 1 quarter, take away 2 fifths, plus 1 sixth, and then we're going to be subtracting, well, 0. So we've got 2 pi times that. So 1 quarter, take away 2 fifths, plus 1 sixth, is 1 over 60. So we've actually got pi over 30. So that is the volume formed.